Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be making sweet potato cornbread. If you're a fan of regular cornbread, you're definitely gonna love sweet potato cornbread. If you wanna learn how to make this recipe, keep watching, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more great cooking videos. Let's jump right into it. You wanna first start off with two sweet potatoes. You can either use two small sweet potatoes or one medium sweet potato will do just fine. I put my sweet potatoes in the microwave. You can boil them, you can bake them, but hey, the microwave is my lazy man version, so I throw them in the microwave. And when you put them in the microwave, it pretty much, you can peel the skin back once they cool and just take all of that potato from the skin and you're good to go. Next, add in some softened butter. Drop in your buttermilk, which you can make homemade with vinegar and milk or you can buy it store brought. Grab you a potato masher, a spatula, spoon, whatever you like and let's get those sweet potatoes incorporated into the milk and the butter like such. Keep mixing until everything is fully combined. Just like this, this is good. Next we're gonna add in sweetener. Now for this recipe, I'm using agave. I do prefer sugar, but for healthier options, you can use agave or honey or any other type of healthier sugar option like date sugar. But again, I do prefer the sugar. I just do. Let's go ahead and get that mixed together. Next, we're gonna add in an egg. You can taste it at this point before you add the egg if you like to see if it's sweet enough, if that's where you want it, because I know sometimes some people like a sweet cornbread and some don't like it so much. Now that we have combined the egg, it's time for us to drop this dry ingredients. This is a one bowl cornbread, baby. A one bowl cornbread, baby! Add in your cornmeal, then add your flour, but my hand, for some reason, went towards the cinnamon. So there's your cinnamon, flour, and we're gonna add in some baking powder. Grab you a spatula, a spoon, or whatever, and let's get this combined. Okay, now we're right where we need to be. This is the consistency that you're looking for. It shouldn't be too watery. It should have somewhat of a thickness to it. We're good to go. Yes. Is this your first time making sweet potato cornbread? Let me know what you think about this recipe in the comment section. Now we're gonna grab a pan or you can grab a skillet, whatever you like. Get it greased up and we're gonna drop that batter into the skillet. your spatula and let's even this batter out. You can also grab the handle of this pan and just kind of shake it a little bit if you want to even it out that way, but this is the way I like to do it. We're going to go ahead and place this in the oven at 350 degrees. Now there are times I place it at 325 and I find that when I place it at a lower temperature, I don't get that many cracks at the top. It just depends on how your oven works. 350, 325. 25 to 30 minutes later, let's butter that cornbread up and you should be good to go. Now it's time to serve up some sweet potato cornbread. Don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more great cooking videos. Let me go ahead and get this cornbread cut because I know you guys want to see the inside. I'm going to see y'all next time. Bye!